The Unsinkable Molly Brown is a, a musical that a lot of people know with Meredith Wilson's um, great music and songs. A writer named Dick Scanlon got permission to go back into the musical and to basically rewrite the book. The original musical had followed more the myth of Molly Brown as opposed to her actual life. And uh, what Dick Scanlon has done is really researched Margaret Brown and her life uh, and made the story um, much closer to what actually happened in her life. And of course Molly Brown has a big Colorado uh, figure and the Molly Brown house is here in Denver and she is a fascinating uh, character. In addition, he was able to go through the Wilson uh, songbook and pull some songs into the, into the musical uh, that had not been there before. So there's going to be a whole new book and new songs um, with some of the familiar songs from before. So it'll be, it's a, it's a new re revitalized version of the musical. I think it's incredibly exciting that he's going to take this existing musical that I think has always had a somewhat weak book, to be frank, um, some great songs, and re-look at that. And, and um, I think it's great that it's going to happen here. I think it has a, certainly a regional significance. The reading is actually interesting because it's a musical. Uh, it, it's being rehearsed for a week in New York with the whole New York cast, and then they will come out here and rehearse for a week. And then after the reading is done here, uh, I think it's the following week, they're going back to New York and doing basically another reading of the musical for backers back in New York. Getting the story of Molly Brown and what she actually did in her life uh, into this musical format, I think is gonna be really a fun adventure to go on. I suspect it will be very popular. Mm -hmm.